With the arrival of the season's first snowstorm and colder temperatures, children are no doubt going to develop a little cabin fever over the next few months. It's coming, right? But there are several free events going on to keep children entertained well, you can, while they get to learn a little bit, too. And Jean Lepke joins us now. She's with KidWinks.com. You have some good ideas, mm -hmm. too. I do. Yes, yes Get I the do. children out of the house. Absolutely. That's right. right. Okay. And we're going to start with the Wilmette Theater. Tell us about that. Starting this weekend, they're having a free children's film festival. So this weekend, they are showing Kung Fu Panda 2. And the following weekend, they're showing How to Train Your Dragon. And then they're picking up again in March. The last two weekends in March, they're showing a couple of movies as well for free, which is a bit unusual in the winter to have these free films. They do it a lot in the summer. So this is an unusual one in the winter. I have to admit, one of my friends is uh, one of the co-owners there. You know, and so it's great. So there's always, besides the free films, there's always other stuff going on. They have a lot of really cool family events too. for families. They really okay. do. Love Ooh. that. Nice. Right. And what about, we saw that um, sculpting of the snow? At Navy Pier, they oh. annually have their snow days, yes. and it doesn't matter if we have our own snow because they make their own snow, and they have these 10-foot yeah. blocks wow. of snow that they bring in artists from around the world to make these beautiful sculptures. So you can watch all of this for free, and they're also going to have some sled dogs for some competition, some snowboarding competitions, and for the first time, some interactive activities for kids so they can do ice bowling and snow painting and have a lot of fun. Those sculptures, some of those are amazing, aren't they? The detail is just incredible. Oh, I, that sounds like fun. Uh -huh. You could probably do it. I could. <laughs> I okay, that. and Chicago museums are having free day, uh, days to enter. That's right. Mm -hmm. You know, Chicago has wonderful world-class mm -hmm. museums here, but it can get a little pricey when families try to go um, to visit the museums. Sure. So almost all of the museums in our city host free days throughout the year, and it's a little hard to keep track of who has a free day when. So on the KidWinks.com website, right on our homepage, we have a link to all of the free days so you can easily find them. And this week and um, through the rest of this month, every weekday at the Museum of Science and Industry, you can attend it for free. Next nice. month, Good. every yeah. Wednesday, Museum of Science oh, and Industry great. is for free. Okay. So Good. those are indoor activities. And what about something that gets mm -hmm. you out and gets you some exercise, like hiking along a trail? The River Trail Nature Center in Northbrook is one of my favorite places to take kids. They have indoor and outdoor exhibits. They have beautiful hiking trails. And outdoor, they have animals in cages who are used to being outside. Mm -hmm. And in the afternoon when they feed the animals, they have this really cool talk for kids. They show them how to feed the animals. And these are, you know, like birds of prey. They're eating mice and things. And they talk about the animals and their food habits. And it's really very mm -hmm. interesting. They're great with the kids. Look, Look how pretty, pretty that is. It's, it's real pretty. There. Just bundle them up, put on the snow boots, and go have some fun, right? That's right. Great Good ideas. Idea. And if you would like a recap of these free events that we mentioned today, and to get connected to Kid Winks, of course, go to our website, abc7chicago.com. It is all listed when you click on the See It on TV tab. Thank Thanks you so much. Thanks very much. Thank you. Still a lot more ahead today.